Hello YouTube, Chrono16 here today. Uh, I'm making today's video concerning the sunspots again. Um, you know, instead of making videos talking about, you know, objects falling to earth that aren't there and other things, I'm trying to make videos that concern all of us here on earth. And the sunspots concern all of us here on earth. The sunspot activity, as I said in my last video, is increasing. As you can see here, rotating around to the earth facing side of the, the sun is new sunspots. Uh, they're not shooting off any major flares, but the forecast uh, forecasts that the, that the uh, chances of X flare flares have risen since these new flares have rotated around to the new part of the sun here. Uh, so, uh, just like I said in the last video, uh, w from these new sunspots that are rotating around on the earth facing side of the sun, as you can see here, there's a whole bunch of them. And actually, there is a record amount of sunspot, sunspots that have formed on the sun. Uh, as they stated earlier here on this particular website here, solarham.com, uh, there is a record amount of solar flares that have rotated around uh, on this side of the sun. In fact, it says here, the official sunspot number for October 20th is 195. This is a new record for solar cycle 24. Three new sunspot regions were numbered on uh, Thursday, 1326, 1327, and 1328. Another new sunspot, 1329, is forming in the southwest quadrant trailing sunspot 1317. Um, so what does this mean? All the sunspots that you see here on the screen uh, means that the earthquake activity will continue to increase there was a 7.4 earthquake as many of you already know at the bottom part of the world as you can see here near New Zealand 7.4 out in the ocean there was no tsunami at all and the reason why there wasn't a tsunami is because uh, some of you may know and some of you may not know uh, that earthquake was uh, uh, if I'm not mistaken 20 miles deep and when the earthquake is that deep in the surface of the earth, there's not going to be any tsunamis. It has to be shallow, pretty shallow, to cause a tsunami uh, to form in the ocean. So there's not any tsunamis there. Um, also, as you can see, like I've already stated, there's a whole bunch of sunspots. And what that means, like I said, the earthquake activity will increase and so will the volcanic activity uh, through October 23rd, like I said in the last video, on up to the end, end part of the month, uh, earthquake activity and volcanic activity will increase. Just wanted you guys to know that. Thanks for watching.